Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though, Heist Man? The foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. We is back at it once again with another episode of Pop the Balloon of Fine Love. This episode 22, Deuce Deuce. You know how we do, man. We judge people over here. That's what we finna start doing, man. We finna get right into it. We finna judge these people. So here we go. Pop the balloon. Find love. Episode two. What's judging people, man? Seem like we got the dudes this time. So, hey. We'll, we'll see. Look at this dude. Come on, man. Grabbing a beard and stuff. The old nigga. Oh, not that little dress. Okay, okay. Oh, look, he got the arms out and showing the tattoos. Bird bed hand rub. Is that a checkerboard burgundy jacket? Them legs skinny. Good God almighty. You got a boss shirt? They still make that? Boss? Hey, he came up walking. Now he just fresh out of jail. He ain't messing with him. See you are lit. Going through the little. Going through the mic. There you go. Let me the mic. <coughs> oh Lord. He a fan. He a fan. He a fan. I'm gonna trust him. DMX, baby. DMX, baby. Who's <laughs> like DMX? Come on, pop up with the commercial. Oh, he's shooting dice. Come on, man. Well, Hello time everyone and welcome shirt. back to my channel. It's your host Arlette and we are here with another episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love and we've got some single men lined up. Make some noise guys. See these dudes. Look at him here. The... <laughs> you guys all sounded the same. <laughs> he got on red socks. So we're going to be bringing out some single women. One, one of them one. Jordans is fake. When she comes around this corner one of those Jordans she's is not type, like the you other. Know, outfit, hair, makeup, everything looks good and you're feeling it. Do not pop your balloon. However, if there's anything you're not a fan of, whatever it may be. Your jewelry look a little long face, over there. If you're not liking it, go ahead and pop that and balloon. Black ones. And I'll go over to a few of you and see why you ended up popping. Are we ready? Okay. Come on, come on. We'll see the bitch. All right. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and bring out our first single lady. On, we'll see her. We'll see her. We'll see what we're working with today, y'all. Hello. Welcome in. I'll have you hold that. What's your name? Okay. Sandra. Sandra, how Sandra. old are you? 39. I okay. had to think about that. Sorry. Yeah, think about it. Okay. <laughs> no, no. Actually, I'm 38. I'll be 39 in November. I'm so sorry. Guys. Make up okay. your mind. Oh, Lord. Here yeah. we go. Already. <laughs> All right. And now, Sandra, what do you do? I am a phlebotomist. Um, I recently um, got into a lead position, but I've been doing phlebotomy for 11 years. She stacked. Um, she tall with it. I don't it. mean to say, um, but I've oh, been doing phlebotomy on. for 11 years, don't but beat yourself I also up. travel as an independent contractor as well. Very nice. Okay. Yeah. Now, what you are some things do you like to do for fun? For fun? Ain't I like nobody pop to, yet. Mm, you can hear it in my voice. I'm so sorry. So, for fun, I like <clears> to do anything that boy. takes me out of my comfort zone. Look okay. at these dudes. So, Recently, I tried kayaking on my my own. On so myself, that oh was my different god! For me. So, like anything that calm down, shorty, calm zone. down, okay. calm down. Yeah. Cool. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Uh, some things that I do look for in a man is um, a man that's going to prioritize me in the relationship, a man that's going to allow me to rest in my femininity, a man. How that this episode? Doesn't um, an hour nineteen minutes? Oh no, no. Excuse me. Oh, I'm speaking of everything that I do want. So yeah, a man that prioritized me in the relationship, a man. She used to be a tomboy, wasn't she? Me to rest in my femininity, a guy. Is she that worried about femininity? Me with gifts and love and look, look. just everything great. Okay, nice. Yeah. Now, what are some deal breakers? Some deal breakers are, I would have to say, a guy that does not prioritize me. Is she um, saying the same thing back in the day? Has a wandering eye. Mm. Uh. And what else? Uh, I mean, that's good enough. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Lord, I'm All right, so we did get a couple of pops. Let's Yo, go we... on over there, see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start right here with your name and age. Uh, Hubert, and I'm 37. Hubert. And Hubert, what do you do? I'm a software. And I'm in software sales. Okay. Yep. Very cool. And why did you end up popping? What is your it? Book? AKA was um, it? Letterman Jackie got well, on. One, I have a child. My son is my first priority. 
Uh, so when someone says they want me to prioritize them, that's a red flag for me. Look, like retired also, football player. Uh, gifts isn't my love language to give. Like I don't, I don't believe in showering people with gifts. I feel like that's earned. Earned. Um, and if you're my partner, you can buy a chick something there now and then, man. Come on now. You know, motivated to do so, I will do so. But like, if that's what you coming in, like I want to be showered with gifts. Wrong guy. That shirt nasty she got on. Okay. This, this shit like no, the damn um, the little rug you put on your on your on the ground be. by the toilet. But I truly believe if I was your woman, you would want to shower with me with gifts. She aggressive. That's awesome. right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, let's go to our next pop sure. balloon. Did she just, did she right, just take the braces off or something? Age. I'm Johnny. I'm 38. And 38. Johnny, what do you do? I am a traffic control man. I'm an artist, I'm a photographer. I do a whole lot of stuff. Okay. He's like an ex basketball so player. So, why did you end up popping your balloon? I mean, like, I know my priorities. I mean, my priorities is my kids. Yeah, Tommy Hill figure shirt. So, I gotta, Where you find that at, man? You feel me? I kind of like you it. You feel me? It kind of look like the old McDonald's <laughs> logo. Yes. T- right. Back but in the when you used to be on the cups and stuff, that colorway. If you take care of yourself first, then you could take care of everyone else. That so part. you wouldn't prioritize your. Don't like you just play for the Portland Trail Blazers or the then Houston Rockets. Look, look at that old nigga. Priority, period. Bingo. Right. Well, so it's everything. not. It shouldn't be a competition between your children and your Drake. No, I'm not fighting it. I'm just saying. I like it. Continue. <laughs> no, Continue. I'm <laughs> Finish. <laughs> All right. So now, is he someone that's your type? That ain't no 38. Okay, and why not? Uh, just no. I, I, Hi, he 38. I'm 41. I can't really this dude say, 38. I, he look older than me. He look 45. He's somebody daddy. He's somebody. I'm like somebody daddy too, but. Street it's vibes. Hmm. There ain't no damn. There ain't no, <laughs> there ain't no 38 year old dude, man. Everybody got a pass, though. Like. But he I'm drank wine. Very positive. I'm an optimistic person. Okay. But um, I should have drank some too. Thank you. Just because. Let's head on back. Check out these deals. Come on, Walgreens. What y'all Walgreens. selling today? Hey, Armor Hammer Baking Soda, OxyClean. Y'all, what else? Charmin. Wipe your ass. Okay. What else? What else? Nice. In sea salt. Three, one cashews. hour delivery when you spend $35. All right, come on. We done with the commercial. And we did get a pop back here. If we can start off with your she name. She's not going to brown dress, though. Uh, my name like is La. I'm 40. Okay. And what do you La. do? I'm an entrepreneur. And oh, stuff, God. You know. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Must have done a beat. So why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just because she said, started off with like, shower you with gifts and things and like you said, that's that's earned. I'm not a selfish person. I do give people gifts, but you couldn't shouldn't come expecting it at first, you know. That shirt nasty he got on though. Why you come dressed like children, that? Children, that's gonna be like the number one priority until you know they're of age. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so now is he someone that's your type? Uh, he's physically fit, but again, the tattoos. I mean, I got a tattoo, but I only have one. I'm not really attracted to the guys with a lot of tattoos. Look, nobody was, her, man. She, yeah. she came off the wrong okay. way. A few more pops. So they trying to get a real body. your name and age. Okay. My name is Micah. Micah. <laughs> and I'm th- uh, 42. He about to say 30-something, see? Uh, I'm a networking engineer. He's 42. In the cybersecurity field. Nice. And why did you end up popping your balloon? Yeah, I ended up popping because just uh, the energy. What kind of shirt he got on? I kind of gravitating to it. So it's D four L. Yeah. B one oh eight. Is Micah someone that you would go for? No. Okay. Why not? Uh, I guess this height. Okay. Just a little. But I've dated short guys before, but I I just don't feel attraction. Yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's go on over here. Let's start with your name and age. My name Brian. Whoa. Thirty eight. Nigga, right. yeah, and Anaku. You got an elongated IT, head. IT. Um, I'm also a personal trainer. Yeah. And why did you end up popping your balloon? I mean, she seemed a little managed to me, you know what I'm saying? And I just, I get that little managed vibe from her. Um, then I got tattoos too, so. Manish, not man is. I, mean, I just get that little manish. managed vibe. I mean, I ain't heard that word in a long cool, time. This nigga you know, old too. You know, I, I like that. She a manish pretty, ass down. You know, my man. aunties and my mama manish. told me that. Do you know what mean by that? Can you elaborate? I can elaborate. Basically, she basically she likes to take control. I can tell she likes to take control. And I'm the guy that likes to take control, of, uh, you know, in my relationship. You know, I lead. So, and do hey, like when them African, um... Okay. Now, is like, he someone like, that's your type? Ancient aliens from the Anunnaki. 
I know, I know what I'm no. talking about, man. <laughs> you have to think about that for a bit. What makes him not your type? Uh, the fact that what he said. Okay. Um, oh, that's why he ain't your type, because he described uh, you to a T. I I like to take control. I like for my man to be in control. Okay. Okay. Right. Hi, y'all. So she ain't got nobody. Here. This, this, start with your this name is a woman. Name's Chad. I'm 38. Chad, I'm 38. Chad, what do you do? I own a mobile pet care business. Mobile right. pet. And why did you end up popping your balloon? Oh, you like groom. You... First thing I heard was being showered with gifts. Damn, the second that thing about was been. when you said, oh boy, down the way it was too short and we're eye to eye. I figured <laughs> I'm in the same boat as him. So, mm. yeah. Okay. Alrighty. So now is he someone that's... Look at Jordan's over there in the <laughs> red. The red yeah, socks. He's being hopeful. <laughs> he's like... He fresh out of jail. So I'm talking about he's 38. Um, no. Dude, about 44. Okay. And why not? About why 47, not to be honest with you. He almost did. Just no attraction. That's an old nigga. I don't care nobody say. Look at his glasses. He put a glass on top of his head. You are last unpopular. Man, I got some glasses. Let's start with your name and age. I ain't cutting Danny, my hair, so I ain't taking my hat off. And Danny, what do you do? I'm an entrepreneur. Okay. Very cool. So you do have your balloon unpopped. With the pleasure, so. P. And this nigga from Ricky Ricky and the Mavericks. And she's very beautiful. I'm just trying to figure out a little more about Ricky, 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 Ricky in the Mavericks. You know, I'm not scared of none of them standards and nothing like that. But, I mean. I like that belt, though. The H belt. Just really I don't tuck my shirt in, though, so I never wear it. I'm just trying to figure out tuck what my she's shirt really in. about. It's good hanging out. Everybody want to be child with gifts. Everybody want, you know, to I show. Wear, I don't go nowhere. I got to tuck my shirt in. They ain't been nowhere nice in a while. I got to go somewhere nice again. But what are you going to do in return, you know, or to earn that? Not quick. Don't talk about what you like that. What am I gonna do in return? I gotta go to my kids' school. Mm, I don't know if I like that. You ain't gotta like it. I'm just saying. Ah, you ain't gotta like it. Shower like gifts without. You like, like with the this. shower? You. Why you got on them jeans? Yeah, it look right. My little language is like. But I like the H belt though. I'm heist man. I like that H. Saying showering gifts. Well, that's the first I thing you said. I also mentioned resting in my femininity as well. Yeah, she ain't cheap. So which the reason why they the reason why they said that is because she didn't. She kind of. Provide something that, like what you do for a man for because that's easy to say. Any woman can come out here and say, Yo, give me some gifts, and I can bust out the bank card and be like, Bop, Bop. you know what I'm saying? But, like, Bop. yeah, I said what makes you like worthy to receive that other than you just being fine. Some Jim B people are good for likes, for likes. Well, if and when you become my man, you would know, and I would be your woman, and that's in every sense. So, like what? <laughs> <laughs> like, what See, she mean? like <laughs> she ain't said nothing the whole like, time. She been up here. My woman mean like you know what I'm saying. I like dude giving girl. you support, giving you you know nurturing you when you need you know when you need to, um, just loving you with a pure heart. I believe she um, got the right intentions. I'm Thirty-eight. Okay, we're saying. All right, where you stay? I live in Wisconsin, Wisconsin. but I'm from Philadelphia. Oh, Born okay. and raised yeah. on the playground is where I spend most of my days. Georgia. Georgia, okay. Where the hell y'all gonna meet up at? You live in Wisconsin. You from Philly. He from Georgia. <laughs> Are you thinking y'all in Arizona shooting this. I'm going to ask you something. Ask you something. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. Like, so throughout the relationships, you're 38. You done been in multiple relationships, right? So what's something that you learned in your past relationships that you can put into your future relationship to make it last longer. Okay. Ooh. Something I've learned from my past relationships. You want to repeat uh, the question? As you as a person, you know as, what I'm saying? To help you grow as a person and say, okay, I'm going to take this say, into my next relationship and it's going to last longer. I would have to say it would have to be patience. I've had to work, you know, on my patience over the years. Um, and I've learned Y'all about to miss out on her? Y'all crazy. Why any dude will pop? That's a queen. Okay. Are we good? Because y'all let the fine. bitch talk out. She like a lot, though. Y'all like, let her talk out out of date, though. What is it like, She ain't really said no like, gold diggery shit. Question? Yeah, ask me something. All right. So on the scale of one to ten, and you can't use seven, um, <laughs> how important... <laughs> How important is it to you that your next relationship ends in marriage? Why you, why you want to take that seven away? I don't want to even get into a relationship unless it can, unless I see it. Man, y'all need to go in. Well, you're here for love, so. Well, my be honest with you, 
my grandmother just passed, right? Oh my God! So I repeat her. But I seen my granddaddy stay by her side, or she was by his side till she could no longer be there. So if I can't envision you being old next to me, I'm not even really gonna give you no energy. To be honest with you, I can give you all the energy of the world, or I could just forget you exist. Mm, that's hard. You know what hard. I'm saying? So. Right, we we got to make a choice. Are you popping or are we walking up there and <coughs> taking a match? What you want? <coughs> Let's go. Oh. See? Come on. So. Were you so All right. Crazy? Come on. Why are you hesitant? No, I'm not hesitant. She's I'm not. I'm trying to figure out what's it like because. Nah. Let's walk up here. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Come yeah, on. get up we there. Go. Get her. <laughs> you don't have to. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. You're crazy. I'll stand. Stand over here. Oh, God. All right. This is seems like an investment. It, a relationship is an investment. You know I'm saying it's gonna be a mutual fund. <laughs> yeah, that's so what you're, a relationship you're, is. You're, you're come to me, and I gotta come to you. You with long you distance. You about to talk and yourself life. out of them? Yeah, I'm open to long distance. What is I'm she? Clingy. Are you? Yeah, I'm talking. About I wrap around you like a spider web. <laughs> I'm done. I she had a good seven. <laughs> she had about an eight. Final questions: Are you going to pop, or are you? She presenting as stay a. Stay with her. Look, how y'all dudes? You can head on back. Sweating <laughs> and everything. Right. These all right. Dudes, well, that is all the balloons pop, gay. unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah. But we do thank you for coming on. Let's Absolutely. go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll take Something wrong with these. I ain't gonna thank call them so gay, much. but you know what I mean, <laughs> man. Y'all these weird. She was she like an eight came in and y'all uh, I don't know. I'm gonna talk myself out of not leaving the world. Y'all crazy. Alright, let's go ahead and bring out our next. If you dare you supposed to be there. See this next one. We'll see what she looking like. We'll see what this is. We'll see what this is. Come Hello, on. welcome. Oh Lord, they popped off gate. What's your name? My name is Crystal. Crystal, how old are you? Uh. I'm 39. And what do you do? I'm a senior level uh, medical coordinator. Okay. Nice. She got that bridge. She's uh, doing something. What do you like to do for fun? Um, for fun, I he, like he popped to off cook. Gate. Um, I look. love um, learning new recipes. I'm getting into outdoor cooking okay. and grilling. Um, I love spending time with family. She's thick, too. Um, I love traveling, and I love wine tasting. Okay. <laughs> and she now, like to get drunk. for a man? Um, in a man, I just need someone that's loyal, um, good with communication. Uh, a talking um, nigga that's going to be there. God, uh. um, as well as big on family as well. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? My deal breaker is a man that don't have a relationship with God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um... I would say a man that's not good with communication, um, a man that smokes cigarettes, mm. and a man that has cats. Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we did get a few pops. Okay. Let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. Oh, pop Let's start here with your name and age. Uh, Hubert. Cat. Uh, 37. Okay. And Hubert, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just Who's initially that? coming around the corner, not physically attracted. Like uh, Lizzo. So I don't want to like waste her time. Or We're not, next. So. Okay. Yep. Got it, got it. They're they dressed. Um, that's your type. Yes, very well dressed and. That's well yeah, dressed? Like he's in fitness, so yeah. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. And then we did get one down over here. All right, let's start with your name and age. Name's Chad. I'm 38. And Chad, why did you end up popping your balloon? I have a fat cat at my house, so. Aww. you're Yeah. <laughs> my dad's popping. Bow, bow, bow. Not a problem. Got it. Now, before she said that, you did have your balloon unpopped. Why so? I just wanted to hear a little more about her. She has a beautiful smile. I just wanted to see what the deal was, but she canceled me, so. <laughs> <laughs> was he, was he a track coach? <laughs> what do you do? Now, is he someone that's your type? I know the cat, but yeah. apart from that. <laughs> yes, very. You look well, Yolanda Adams? Cut, she like she sang in the gospel. Into self -care. I in, love in the choir. Okay. Mm hmm. Nice. Thank you. All right, let's head on. I like them shoes you got on. I like them. Oh, let's Lord. Get your name and age. I'm Johnny. I'm 38. Okay. And I'm Johnny, Johnny, what I'm did you call nigga. You know, 38. I mean, I'm into like more taller female. Okay. I mean, she's gorgeous. And she looked like she got a good spirit and whatnot. She got a big spirit and behind yeah, her. Yeah, I hope she found what she's looking for. <laughs> you feel me? You feel now, me? Now, is Johnny someone that's your type? Um, I mean, I love his personality. He seemed very charming. So, yeah. Okay. Indeed. Thank you. 
And we got another one right here. Let's start with your name and age. My name is Brian from D.C. I'm 38. Okay. And Brian, why did you pop your balloon? Just not really my type, you know what I mean, physically. Uh, you know, and I'm baby hairs is nasty. Lipstick on I peep that, and then I actually get to walk on the way, and I see a little pedicure could be a little better on the bottom. Wow. But other than that. On the bottom of her feet. He judging. That's not my type. Okay. Get him, girl. Get him. Now, is uh, Brian someone that you're Oh, yeah. Most definitely. He's um, well put together as well. Um, Seems like he's very ambitious and know what he's looking for. So, he do thank you. You're welcome. Because at the bottom of her feet, and pedicle right here, like you. Let's start with your name and age. What type my of dudes is Micah, is y'all? And I'm 42. Okay. Micah, why did you pop your balloon? I popped my balloon just just because of the just the physical attraction wasn't there. Okay. Yeah. But you look really nice, though. Thank you. How's she going to look really nice between physically? Micah, someone that's your type. Oh, my God. They all are nice. Oh. <laughs> um, I would say he's very well put together. You guys really put it together tonight. And um, self-care is a plus. So, yeah, I like the trim. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and one more down over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Uh, my name is La. I'm 40. La. Um. You have a beautiful smile. Thank you. But I don't think the aura like did it for me. Like, and bring it in. And also, the baby hairs look crazy. You said a man of God. I'm not an atheist or nothing, but mm -hmm. you know, I'm not in church every right, Sunday don't or cast you know, me out for miles. So that's pretty much it. Beliefs. Well, I want to disappoint you on Sunday. <laughs> well, <laughs> when it comes to that, I said a man that has God involved in his life. Not saying you have to go to church every Sunday, but I, I understand. Okay. Yeah. Okay. She is. She is. One more down. She is six. How y'all? This bitch is. She is six. She could be a seven on her best. <laughs> All right. This your her name, best. age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. Danny, I'm 38. She is just she uh, seven. The last one was an eight nine. Very beautiful. Very well put she together. She eight can turn into nice a nine. Smile. She is six can be a seven. Where you say you was from? I'm in Houston. Yeah, I'm not. Y'all crazy. Where are you? Atlanta. Oh, okay. I live in Atlanta <coughs> there often, but okay. You know, be cool. All yeah. Right. So now, is he someone that's your type? Yes. Cool, smooth daddy. <laughs> <laughs> I love um, the boots. and The, the pants is nasty. Seems like he can get on the grill with me, but okay. All right. Let's head on back. <laughs> All right, so that is all of the balloons popped, yeah. unfortunately, but we do thank you for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for These guys. ain't the best thank looking you. dudes in the world either. I don't know what their expectations was. Like, Y'all crazy. These ain't the best looking dudes Where in the world. Where are we? The home of the legendary scents of the Old Spice. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Let's see what this is. Come on. What you working with? Hello, welcome in. Oh, What's Lord. your name? My name is Johiko Rodriguez. Johiko? Yes. Okay. She came How in with a you? nasty I am walk. I'm 39 years old. And 39? I am a dedicated and passionate social worker, and I also have several businesses. I also um, and hosting business, yes. and I also do an intimate fitness course. What is that, a blazer okay. cut up? <laughs> you out are busy. Yes. <laughs> now, what are some things I could do for fun? Um, well, I try to travel at least once or twice a month, if not every other month. I a just month? came from Aruba last weekend. Aruba? Here this weekend. Who knows where I'm going to be next weekend. Okay. Um, I'm, a social, I, I'm a social butterfly, so I like to be in social settings, so anything that involves karaoke show a face we need to see a face day parties okay. things of that nature we work hard so you know we got to play, play hard, hard. Uh -huh. <laughs> she came <laughs> in looking like an eight we got to see what um, she looked like first it's that big ass hair got to go um exterior definitely is important i love a guy that looks good mm -hmm. but the interior matters more like your character and you know like who you are as a person yeah um I love someone that's fun and energetic and social like me. You sure some buck um, teeth, don't you? I don't see these rabbits. Yeah. Come okay. on. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Don't lose face, My deal breakers. I don't do addiction. So if you're addicted to porn, OnlyFans, gambling, I do none of that. Um, what lying, I do is shooting dice early. <laughs> um, someone who's judgmental. I'm very judgmental. Um, yeah. Okay. I'm going to say All it. Right, so we did get but I'm think it. Let's go on over there see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, if we can Man, have your name and age. I'm Brian, 38. DC. Brian. How you doing? I'm good, and yourself? Good, good. Um, All right, Brian, why did you end up popping your balloon? Well, she, physically, she's not my type. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, oh. Physically not my type. 
Okay. So I That's okay. It. Now, is uh, Brian someone that's your type? Why are you looking at it like that? Like, um, shit, I nephew. would say no. And why not? Um, I'm more into someone that just dresses a little bit more... I mean, I'm, I want someone that dresses diverse. Look um, at you! But just someone that for you got on a blazer with the back I think cut out. With your best impression, so yeah, them um, shoes look long as yeah, shit. Yeah, that's it. But you're you're a very good looking guy. I'm not gonna lie. Nice height. I like the size of the jeans. You look good. The size of the jeans. No problem. Let's go to our next pop balloon here. If we can have your name and age. I'm Johnny. I'm 58. Okay. And Johnny, why did you end up popping your balloon? I'm just into a more like taller girl. Okay. Why not? But you're gorgeous. Thank you. I'm mean on them 38. I'm going to say that every time, time I see his face. Um, Old man face. I would say no. Okay. <laughs> Why not? Um, just the wardrobe. And just looking at the exterior. I haven't heard anything from you yet, so, you know, I can't say too much. But just from looking on the outside, I just feel, again, you know, being that this is a dating show, mm -hmm. um, you know, you got to come with your best. Like you fresh out of jail. Yeah. Have a good night. You too. Thank you. And we did get one pop back here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Yeah, my name is Mike. I'm 42. And uh, the reason... Mike. How you doing? I'm good. And yourself? Doing good. Thanks. Okay. So the reason I popped was just... Why are you standing like that? The attraction wasn't there for me. Okay. Physical attraction wasn't there. Okay. Was there something specific? He, he, uh, he, really not specific. Just he's like his, like his shoulders too big for his arms or something. Like, no, like no, that shit weighing no, it down. Is Mike someone that's your type? Yeah, actually, right, Mike would be someone that's my type. Um, very nice looking. I love someone that's super well groomed. The he like a well groomed Gucci point, man. Oh, he look like he like Gucci man. Yeah, the aesthetics. I'm here for it. Goo wop. I appreciate that. Thank no you. No problem. Thank you. And then look at him, like, Gucci's one brother. Here. Let's head on over here. Gucci. All right, your name and age. Oh, he look like the like ugliest rapper alive. Like he look like both of them dudes. I'm Danny. Oh, look at this guy. He smiled you? too What's much. Chohiko. 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 Well, I'm Sometimes big, you um, coughed up. <coughs> you know, having a type. Got that Joe Eco. You know, and she described her type pretty much to the T, and I didn't see myself in it. You know what I'm saying? So you got to do a dash about me. And be ain't willing oh, to do that because I ain't your type. And it's all yeah, you got to be the only. Well, who told you yeah. you weren't my type? Yeah, you know. You did with your discretion. He, 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 he okay. swear too much. Okay. He, All right. Yeah, yeah. So now is he your type? What's yeah, he up? is somebody that would be my type. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, very well dressed. Yeah. He came with the collared shirt on. I love the pants. Chelsea boots. The pants you nasty. You came dressed for the occasion. You look good. Got a clean cut. Am I missing out the on these pants? It's like some you know, but Jason Voorhees. He's got to pop that water so with. I, I don't wear pants like that. Blockers on. It's all good. So. I actually I don't wear no tight ass pants. Head. I don't wear no tight ass pants with ruffles and rip claws and stuff in there. You should take that balloon back then. What's up? Uh oh. I'm saying. <laughs> I pop. Look, I pop. <laughs> the rest of the dudes, I pop. Uh oh. <laughs> All right. You don't want so you? we do have three balloons left unpopped. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask the remaining guys a question just to help you narrow it down, see who's more of your match. Okay. Bottom dudes, so I'd be like. I guess I would first ask you guys, um, where are you from and what do you do for a living? Okay, let's start here with your name and age and the answer to her question. She looked uh, thirsty. La, uh, forty. She turned to a um, seven. What's your I'm name? I'm sorry. Excuse me. Your name? La. La. Okay. Yeah. La la. Nice to meet you. Um, la, pretty la. much I'm an entrepreneur. Do. I'm um, investor. Uh, I'm into fitness. I got a, a university, Body uh, State University, uh, and also a restaurant, Supreme Empanada, in New York City. Okay. Check out these deals. She ain't the impressed. At Walgreens. She want the other nigga. <clears throat> It's gonna fuck over her. <laughs> you can tell. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, let's go to our next guy. Your name and age. That nigga down there, a player. Uh, Hubert. My age you ain't got no chance, Hubert. Uh, I'm in software sales and I have a podcast. Okay, nice to meet you. Your name, uh, your name alone. We have one more down over here. You can All tell right, bitches your name, name Hubert. Age and the answer to her question. My name is Hubert. I'm 38 and I own a mobile pet care business. Oh, cute. You go around nice cutting dog hair. Yeah, that's what's up. You the barber to the dog. You fade them up. That's why you gotta so fade, you gotta hold the head. Time <laughs> fade to them up. Hold. A balloon. So I'm gonna go ahead and hand you a pig. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Hubert. He like you got on a barber so jacket. Guys, I haven't seen barbers wear that. Pop one of their shit, he got on Hubert. I couldn't ask a question first. Nah. No. Next round. At least two people only. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. Give me one second, please. Okay. Let me see here. Okay. <laughs> oh, that little African shit coming that's out of nice. her. Oh, that's nice. Thanks. Wow. That's trouble. Oh, God. 
Okay. Well, he popped his. He popped. Let's come Let's on go. over here. <laughs> so why did we end up popping Hubert? Um, the hesitation. Like, I need my woman to be like, know what she want and make the decision. Also, um, you like a goldfish. You like a little fish. Don't like a fish. I don't like. Um, I'm not really big on like weave, and if I can see your braid, uh, and then like, like the I can see the bump in the back. Oh, um, the braids. Okay. Yeah. Is it the braids? <laughs> um, wow. The tooth. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. All right. Well. <laughs> Is Hubert someone that's your type? I know you had a little hesitation yeah, when... Yeah, no, I mean, he is someone that would be my type. I mean, I, just, again, based on the exterior, because I haven't heard anything from him yet. Yeah. Um, the dress code, yes. Uh, the demeanor on the facials, it's just giving I don't want to be here. Um, but aside from that, um, yeah, he's somebody that I would probably... Nigga yeah. said the tooth. All right, thank you. Right. Okay, I'll go ahead and have you ask Dang. two guys a question that are left. Um... Speaking of aesthetics, how are you guys when it comes to like your women and um, consistency? I know some guys don't like a woman that changes a lot. You know, they want her to stay in shape, the she face. gains weight, she... they lose interest. Because personally, I'm someone that I, when it comes to my hair, I change it a <laughs> lot. I have no braids, to be honest. I actually have a shortcut under here, but my hair is down my back. Um, but I've done different type of things with my hair. I am always changing. So how that, comfortable that, that. are you? With the consistency, and got into, of like they got into her psyche. Women changes you her still hair, talking to that one man? You know, we talk to them too. Losing weight. Get the focus. Um, as far as your hair, that's your hair. That's, hair don't make you, so it don't matter to me. Okay. Um, you trying to win stuff? I'm gonna try to look good for you, so you gotta always look good for me. Wow. You know, so I went once for like 40, 30 pounds. I'm gonna say, baby, let's go get in the gym. Let's go get it together. You know what I'm saying? But if you reluctant, then I might be out of there. I ain't gonna lie. Mm. Okay. Let's go down over there. That's dumb. I'm gonna go ahead and answer a question. Uh, that would be no problem for me. I think that. Uh, you love somebody, you growing right with now. somebody, y'all yeah, just. That would be no problem for me. I'd actually. How you gonna uh, appreciate you? coming with different styles and looking a different way. As uh, far as the weight fluctuation, it didn't look like you would have too much of that going on. So. Thank you. <laughs> and the activities I love to do, uh, that would probably prevent you from even you know, gaining weight. I, I, I don't know why you'd ask that. You look great, but. Um, well, I'm asking because, you know, I ha I mean, I don't, I don't mind because he was so wrong with the braids. I don't. Look, damn. You, you want to take it out? Do snatch yeah. snatch I mean, your shit off. I mean, you know, I mean, why can't I? So. She did a damn a hair reveal. Good. Good. <coughs> so should I keep it off or? Okay. Yeah, she look better with it off. <laughs> Throw your head, bitch. Okay. Oh, earring just fell. lost the earring. Um, well, but yeah, that. so that's yeah, why I asked because I'm always changing my hair. I go from short. I just was bald a few months ago. I have super long hair. I do all. No, you don't. You have short hair. Natural. But you know, I came on the show today, so I was like, all right, let me try to yeah. do a little something. But this is this is me. So I just want to make sure you're okay with me and who I am. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Look, look, look at dude. He's like, damn. Look, no, you look good. You look yeah, good. I did it for you. Cause you talking about I had braids. I'm like, braids. He's I seen the bump. Now this is your, your head. <laughs> okay, so our two remaining guys. Any questions for our beautiful lady here? Nigga, talk. He's got blowing his shit back up. Like, damn. Yeah. You have kids? I do. I was married for 11 years, so oh. I had three wonderful children. Damn, three. Um, I have a push cordial three relationship puppies? with my ex-husband. We do 50-50, so. Whoever my partner She's kind of look like that girl from um, The Bear. A week, my kids are gone. A week, they come back. By her little me, face. So, uh, she look better without that shit on her head. Father, you can see her face so now. So that wouldn't be a concern, if that is a concern, because that tends She's to be stacked, a concern at times. You should have came in like more that. Kids. I'm open to more kids, yeah. You didn't jump up. Yeah, I snapped back. <laughs> Agatha. Agatha. remember why you hate me. Tonight. You so witch. Okay? How long have I been here? So hey, come on tonight. Okay. I mean, check it out. I don't want no more kids. I don't. I, I'm open to it. Open to I'm it. I'm open to it. <laughs> but not. to be honest, I do have three. But that would be a decision that we would have to make. You don't want no more. Neither do I. I didn't say I want. It's mm. not a. It's not a need for me. I already have three. But for example, I'm open to it if the, my partner wants it. Oh. 
Okay. I'm not open though. <laughs> and that's and, fine. And that's what and I'm telling you. I got you. two kids. Yeah, you that's cool. That's cool Just with fuck me. Fuck them kids after that. Oh, yeah, fine. He's fuck them kids. I'm about effing kids. <laughs> but I'm totally open. If I don't need to have any more. I understand. But I'm open to it if my partner. She look all that better now. Now that fits her style. With any questions bullshit down over here? Blazer. Let's head on over here. Any questions? She got on. Where do you live? I live in Florida. Fort Lauderdale, to be exact. Fort Lauderdale. Where do you live? Vegas. Oh, okay, so you wouldn't be willing to do long distance temporarily? Too far. Well, I mean, because, uh, listen. I'm I'll, grounded. I'll move for I'm love. At. I'm just saying. I'll she move trying to love. win. I, the dating pool, there's fecal matter in it right now. <laughs> so I can't be so picky. It really anymore. is. I used to be super picky. Is, I, he can't be bald. He can't be this. Move? I'm, I'm, yeah, I've had long distance the balloon relationship. Back. Okay, let's get that balloon back. <laughs> She's trying to win with somebody. I'm serious. <laughs> I'm looking at you. You looking at me? You see me? I'm looking at okay. you. Y'all got the same yeah. hairstyle? So. <laughs> <clears throat> Nigga from the win the bitch. Now she looking at him like, uh. And I got three kids as well. Well, yeah. the Brady Bunch, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I'm okay with that. I don't have an issue with that. I prefer. And the <laughs> nigga about to be yeah. weak. Look at him. He feel like he won. Look. Look. Yeah. He's so happy. That's it. Uh, you could if you know, want. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that, that was, was an accident. accident. We know that was an accident. He tried to catch it. <laughs> all right. So. Oh, Lord, I, I said he did all that. There's no other questions between the two of you. What's the question? All right. No so question. then, is it a yes for you for her? It's a yes. Uh, is it a yes for you for him? It's a yes. We got a man. Hey, that's what's up. She was <laughs> okay, leaving with something. She was thirsty. I seen the thirst in her. Oh, she wanted to leave with something. This bitch, I've got to take the hair off. Her. Something. All right. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single up. lady. She, her stock went up, though. When she took that shit off her head. All right, we'll see the next one. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? The Storm. Valisha. Valisha? Yes. How old are you? Valisha. I'm 37. And what do you do? I'm a real estate agent and broker okay. in the Arizona area and D.C. Come around and well. see your face. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, what are some things like to do for fun? Um, I'm really chill. I like speakeasies. I like staying at home and cuddling sometimes. Easy. I like um, adventuring. I try anything at least once. So. Nice. Okay. Yeah. She looks now, soft. What are some things you look for in a man? Um, I'm looking for someone who is also adventurous, someone who's looking for a serious relationship with the goal of marriage. Mm -hmm. um, I'm looking for someone who she is. Missed, she been bang. I guess multi around. Okay. She been around. Yeah. Now, what are some deal breakers? Um, I know it's cliche, but I I would say cigarette smoking. Um, seven. Uh, I won't say well, six bodies. General, but lifetime. It depends. <clears throat> um, I don't mind if a man has kids, but I would like to know how old if under they two do. for me might be a dis discussion to be had okay <laughs> um outside of that i would say is, other thing is playing you? video games on a daily basis and it's not for your hobby i mean it's not for your profession mm. a hobby is a yeah little problem okay <laughs> yeah all right so we haven't got any pop balloons thank you so i am gonna go ahead and switch it on over hands. to you she so she let can't me grip you one. Hit. She ain't never uh -oh. had okay let me have you hold that, and mm. I am going to have you pop. She don't look experienced two enough. <clears throat> based off of what you're seeing, whoever doesn't really fall into your type, whatever. She look like. Is, go ahead and pop two. Balloons. She coming no off questions? as no TV mom. Right. I know it's tough. <laughs> you know. <laughs> All right, guys. No, I don't. I'm sorry. Okay, and then one more. She don't oh have. God. She don't have. She, she don't have. She okay, don't have no. Let's start right here. She don't here. have sex okay. appeal. Uh, she just, your name and age. <clears throat> Hubert, 37. Okay. And Hubert, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Uh, I was trying to give her a little bit of time to warm me up. Okay. She didn't say anything she, too bad. Um, I did notice some things see, she, that I don't like, but, mm -hmm. you know, I was just trying to give her some grace. She okay. Good but six, is she good someone seven. that's your type, like you would usually go for? Um, she cool. She cool. Ain't nothing wrong with her. She, 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 she just ain't got no right. appeal. <laughs> So why do ain't nothing standing out. Balloon? She just look regular. Because well, it's a tough choice up here. Um, but I would. I this dissecting it with my eyes. Vibe in the eye contact. Like, okay. I was just getting from other. Ain't nothing wrong I with her. Had to make a decision. But ain't nothing standing okay. out like oh and shit. Let me holler at her. More. Let's head on over here. I'll walk past. Me. Walk right past her. My name is Micah. I'm 42. And Micah, why did look, you have your balloon? Excuse unpopped? me. Let me get through here. I like the things she was saying. It was kind of interesting. The things you were saying. Uh, and you seem you got like good energy. You seem like you have good energy. Thank you. So yeah, I'm so she nervous. <laughs> she is. She's right, quiet. Why she do weak. we end up popping heads? Tell her she had um, seven wieners in her. 
Oh my God. In um, initial attraction. I would just say it. It's nothing that I could pinpoint. I just didn't feel the initial attraction there. She got. Yeah. She need a thug. That was you need. Popeye's wings are the official wings. Somebody's gonna scare her. Win the she been scared every- yet. She been with the same dude. Yeah. All right. All her life. So she, be, she had long now, relationships. Go ahead and ask a question. All right. All her so relationships I been. I just want to know, like, two years uh, plus. a little bit about what some of you guys like to do for fun. Okay. Cool. College Your boyfriend. Name and age, high what do you like to do for fun? Uh, my name is La. I'm 40. I like to travel. I pretty much travel. Um, I like doing comedy shows. And, you know, she ain't fuck with no hood niggas. I'm telling you. Adventurous stuff too. You know, I'm an adrenaline junkie. You know, got motorcycles and. Jet skis and stuff like that. That's pretty much. Awesome. Let's head down over here. Your name and age, and what do you like to do for fun? My name Brian, 38 Brian, from DC. 38 from um, DC. What I like to do for fun um, is pretty much typically travel. Um, I like to be by the water. Um, honestly, I adventurous, so I spontaneously do anything that my woman like to do. Yeah. Um, and that's pretty much it. That's pretty much okay. it. All right. Over here, your name and age, and what do you like to do for fun? I'm Johnny. I'm 38. Um, babe, I don't have fun. <laughs> it's always work with me, but at the same like time, like a truck I'm driver. This person, I'm a personality. You're like a truck I, driver. I love, you know what I mean, it's hard to explain. Either like Chris Bosh daddy. daddy. That's who that father, is. So it's like, That's Chris Bosh daddy. Yeah. All work, no play. I mean, Chris yeah. Bosh okay. run. Indeed. <laughs> Your name and age, and what do you like to do for fun? I mean, he, I'm Danny. I'm he's played ball all overseas. I'm a little bit of brainiac. A tall I like nigga. to play chess. Um, I got a podcast where I read from Prosperity Bible. Oh, okay. Um, I recently retired from basketball. Not as good as I thought I was. That nigga look. Um, he, that, that tall nigga looking okay. like nigga. We all have and dreams. Then, um, look how he looking at him. That boy. Look at him. So that tall nigga used to play. Running up the mountain and stuff like that. He's played overseas. I got a couple of kids, so like whatever they like to do, I'm into. I'm real supportive with that. So, you know, I like to just create fun. Over in Greece somewhere, I'm telling you. Okay. You know, talk shit a little bit. It's an old nigga. I like that. Okay. You find out about that old nigga. Head on back. He used to play ball. He used to play ball overseas, man. Based off of everything you've heard, what you've seen, he back home. I'm gonna have you pop one. Driving driving trucks for the past seven years. I know. Old nigga, look. Okay, so why did we end up popping his? Um, for me, it was just a preference on the face tattoo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's just not. Indeed, yeah, that's it. Indeed, so, yeah. You see. All right, so Johnny, why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? I mean, she's gorgeous. Thank she you. looks like you kind of look like New Jersey twerk. Thank you. I understand. His okay. mouth structure, right. Paul. That sounds crazy. Uh, his right. mouth look like New Jersey. Ask the remaining guys. He, he, he kind of like New Jersey twerk okay. and eyes and, and the shit. So like that. if money were no option, where Big would you nine. live? And where do you live now? Okay. Start over You're here. Strapped in. Hmm. I'll clap you, you know, in the same time. He's still thinking. Let's go on. Snapped in. Moment. Let's start down here. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. All right. Answer to your question. You know, I lived a lot of places. I like I like Atlanta. Okay. Um, oh. I like the network. You've been in Atlanta, uh, so I know what you like then. If you're from Atlanta. To be honest with you, I live in Atlanta. Okay. <laughs> so he's swaying, he's swaying uh, around too much now, and that's why. You want to stay? That's why he's moving like that. He from Atlanta. You want to go nowhere? <laughs> All right, we be honest. You know, being honest, I probably would stay like somewhere. That's by the water, but don't get all the BS that water bring, like tsunamis and all that stuff. Like okay. I like Atlanta because the weather is perfect. You know, it's, it's it's cold for like a short period of time, and then everything else is straight. And I don't like drama. I don't like weather. I don't like you don't like drama in Atlanta. Chill, cool. Got gotcha. you. So that's why I choose Georgia. Okay. No tornadoes okay. and stuff. I like it. <laughs> Got family there. <laughs> okay. All right. On over here. So you, your question was, um, where would I live? Or what was your question? Um, if sorry. money were no option, where would you live, and where do you currently live? Well, I currently, I'm currently residing in the DMV area, outside of DC, Maryland okay. area. DMV. Um, but uh, if money, basically saying if money was an option, well, honestly, I would like to live somewhere where it's nice and hot, like maybe Florida, somewhere like that, somewhere where Arizona. It's, Arizona, cool. I actually like it out here. It's, it's pretty <laughs> chill, you know, a little hot, but it's Florida like, overrated. East Coast, um, but. Yeah, somewhere where it's water, beach at, where I can, you know, like to be by the water, so. Okay. Okay. All right. Cool. All right. 
Oxyclave. Clean your oxy. <laughs> Looks like laundry day is today. It's today. Okay, you got some time. All right. That's your answer. Um, if money wasn't an option, definitely like a Bali or somewhere. Bali. Somewhere different, like just a whole different country or something. And okay. I'm currently residing in New York. Okay. Yeah. Bali. All right. At all places. All right. It is time to pop. Oh. Yes. Pop in nigga from line. Pop out of these three guys three who's been Bali. literally popping. One? Just one. Mm -hmm. All right. Go somewhere okay. secluded with me, everybody. Right. I'm sorry, boo. Okay, why did we pop his balloon? And then pop I have to. I like. <laughs> it's not an easy choice up here, but um, he seemed like he wasn't really sure mm. on his answer. He and, not. Yeah, you looked a little confused. Um, but it's okay. I don't want to stand. Yeah, Adrian though, like, Bronner. That's just not. And that, and that my AB, vibe, the so boxer. Don't really like say where you want to go then. No, I want to hear from you. This is <laughs> about us. you want, babe? This is togetherness. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, Danny, why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? Um. She got like a natural goddess type vibe. Um, she seemed like she's caring. She like and, a school teacher, um, man. She really teach kindergarten. Dives deep into a relationship and falls head over heels and make whatever. Second grade at the high. Tries to make it work. She had an you know elementary school teacher. Yeah. So I was hearing her out, and she's very. Attractive. I can see her on you know Abbott so Elementary. She like she's easy guest going, starring on there. Cool to teacher. kick it with. She a teacher vibes. Oh, yeah. She got. Uh, he did a lot of. Thank you for that. Appreciate <laughs> she, it. She, 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 she. All right. So we do have two guys left. Right. Guys, she, she, any she questions seven. for you know, our you know, lady here? Out. She ain't. You have one. Okay, we'll start here. Then we'll as a it. five, she I'm hired in the six. She has kids, right? I don't. Of course, she ain't gonna Do you want to be a mother? I do. Hey, there you go. You're beautiful. Thank you. I would never try to waste your time. That's something everybody should experience if they want to. Mm -hmm. Don't like he part of um, don't have, like, full force. And I have two kids. Don't he like he part of that, that group? On his face look like Yeah, that. I definitely want someone who's still open like to the idea, even though I may not have Lou. kids. I still want Lou someone open to the idea. Full force is okay. height. Yeah. Now, prior to you know her saying she wants more and kids, yeah, from, um, popped twice he called it house party. We ain't gonna kick your fucking face. He look like one of them. He like the son of one of them. I like that. Um, in the face. Yeah, she has like a, a good demeanor about her. Thank you. Thank now, is Law someone that you like? I, I, I do think if he was outside, I would say hi. I would, hey. <laughs> I would entertain you. Okay. Yeah. Entertain you? You ain't talking. We do have so one you ain't seven seven left yeah. unpopped, and he did have a question. Okay. What's your question? Um, so my question is, in the household, what, what? is the, as, as far as the roles? He like he got on bozo the clown it, shoes. Them shit is long like as hell. The man role and the woman role. What does it look like in, in your household? All right, so I'm a little old school, and I'm glad you asked this because yeah, I was raised some by my parents boats. and also in a Christian upbringing. Okay. So I do value the man as the lead, okay. and I'm going to, with good reason. Who like sideshow Bob with shoes on? And I want to make sure from the Simpsons. Sasha Bob shoes as long as hell. His leadership, but I definitely feel like that comes first. And if I do get married, my husband is also going to come before everything and everyone else. Even if I do have kids, some people take that wrong, but you know what I'm saying. Biblically, I have the order. Okay. So right. you're, you're a church like a good ass if I did. Um. <laughs> All right, let me bring you up. Come on up here. Let's, <laughs> let's come on up Long here. ass shoe, look at him. All right, y'all. Any final questions? <laughs> I did. I wanted to know you have children. Yes, I have two boys. <coughs> five and 18. Okay. I like that. Yeah. <coughs> what do you look for in a woman? Well, honestly, I look for a woman that's like you, you just described yourself submissive. Let the man lead. Know what they want. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Respect. I'm big on respect. Yeah. Uh, you know, a woman oh, that's. You know, that I'm knows sorry, what she wants. man. And um, that's shoes it. took me out. You know, okay. when I seen them up like, that. like big from that's the it. side view, is okay. different. But you see them, okay. Well, then, with this being said, is it Boy. gonna be a yes for you for her? I am think it's gonna be a yes, yes. Okay, I have one more question. Oh, look, oh my look, god, we're trying okay. to get well, out of it's, it's, it's not, not a deal breaker. I just wanted to know what part of the DMV because I live in the DMV too. Well, I, I'm I grew up in southwest DC. Okay. So, like I said, I'm in the area. I'm like uh, outside of Maryland right now. So, okay, I'm in Silver Spring. Okay. Oh, that's close. So. Wow. He said yes. Now, is it going to be a yes for you for yes. him? We got a match. <laughs>
That's what's up. Maybe y'all can float back on his shoes. Like, Ride his shoes you back. You guys can go on up. Go ahead. Some shit long as hell. Look. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's give it up for them. <laughs> them things are long, boy. Look. Nobody Look, damn clown. A clown. Look at all these people. The Joker. Who do you think they see? We gotta go through this whole damn thing. Come on. Check out these deals of the week at Walgreens. 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 All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. All right, we'll see the next one. Come on. See this. We'll see this. Hello. Where's she at? In. What's your name? My name is Kat. Kat, how old are you? I'm 35. And what do you do? I'm an electrician. Oh, and I also model. <laughs> now, what are some things you do for fun? Um, I like to. I like to do everything. I like to go shoot pool. Uh, you want play space, rap money? Uh, skating. Is she Indian? Okay. Arabic? <laughs> now, Is she light skin? Some things you look for in a man. It's like Candace um, Parker. Who's so this? I'm looking for someone who is genuinely trying to get to know me and court me and make me a part of their situation that looks, that looks. and not just, you know, keep me around as a placeholder. Mm. And okay, now what, what are some what? deal breakers? Deal breaker. Um, what, 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 she look kind of... Bad hygiene. Okay. Someone See, this would be a six. What you're doing all day <laughs> with no, like, substance to the conversation. She a six, but could be um, something. She could be something. She can be moved up to an eight. <laughs> No problem. Her her so hairstyle is probably it's not doing it right for her. Ended up popping. Okay. And she All right, if we can have your name and age. She, she, she kinda I'm Danny. I'm 38. Okay. And Danny, why did you end up popping your balloon? You know, she's a very beautiful woman. Came out here with presents. Um, but we just being completely honest. I got a type. I like mine's. You know. A little bit thicker, you know. I'm like no ass, it won't last type dude. So yeah. like, we'll see it. <laughs> just oh know, Lord, look at them talk. Here to find my type. Okay, no right. problem. Lord, All right, now is Danny someone that's your type? Um, he's okay. I don't know him personally, but he's honest. So she don't know how to like wear. That. She don't know how to wear them shoes. She wearing them. She, her feet was her toes Thank spread you. out. She was. We did get a pop back here. Still got a type, but it's kind of sad. Yeah, my no, name is done. Micah, and I'm 42. I think he's scared of every girl. He, he pop and look down. The reason I pop was because uh, 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 just the overall, uh, just oh, that's a Dior shirt. It I'm a broke nigga. I ain't got no Dior shirt. Um, gravitating to it. Uh, Do I? Just some of the things she was talking about. It didn't seem a lot. I do the middle name life. Dior. So. <laughs> and now is uh, Micah someone that's your type? Um, he's okay. Also, um. It's not ugly, so that's cool. <laughs> she she probably she probably played volleyball all her life okay. and basketball. Right. Thank you, Micah. <laughs> she a tomboy, but still like this is like her first dress. All right. So she we don't do not have a... uh, three guys remaining. I'm she got, go she got the wrong ask shoes ask on. Question, just to help us narrow it down. Okay, what's you guys' toxic trait? Oh lord. Okay. Hey, what's that, your toxic trait? Let's that's the ugly name dress name she got first. on too. Uh, my name is La. I'm forty. Um. I don't know. I don't think I got no toxic traits. Uh, that's the toxic trait right there. Might be. <laughs> <laughs> nah, well, she no. like the she like the Indian share. Yeah, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I can't even tell you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nothing Not scares nothing scares the women away. Huh? Nothing scares the women away. I don't know. I don't think so. Her, she she been fucking her homeboys. I don't believe you. <laughs> she got she got like a little beat too. She got a beat going. Nothing about you like man. I should really work on this That's one piece right. of me. Like what's her ethnicity? Um, shit. I think in my younger like if she presented you know, herself younger, as an yeah, Indian woman, you know, she probably she, she probably mix. Face, but I think. You know, well, when's the last time you've been in like a relationship? Uh, in a relationship. I want to say about eight years. She had Napoleon Dynamite mouth. What the fuck? What do you mean? When was the last time you were in a relationship? Yeah, like eight, eight years, years ago. ago. Gosh. Eight years ago, everything was perfect. Nah. See, she, she a, a homegirl, man. man. You know? <laughs> Spit it out. She a homegirl, yo. <laughs> nah, it wasn't. <laughs> she a homegirl. <laughs> you plead the fifth. Why do we? <laughs> You plead the fifth. Why we end up popping? <laughs> she nah, got homie vibes. Don't she don't believe that I, I could just be too good to be true. That's it. I said I don't know. She got homie vibes, yo. Know. Have you met men? No, I don't talk to men. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> she been hooping. Gotta, she a hooper. I have to talk to Trey too, so. Okay. Yeah, but she's a beautiful girl now. 
No problem. So let's go She's to straight. Other two guys then. She has six and be could be made an eight. eight. She has trait? six. Uh, Hubert, 37. Uh, I have three. Oh. Um, oh, I'm flirtatious. I can be moody. Uh, and I can sometimes be nonchalant about my attachment. Okay. Yeah. Come on, fro. All right, we got one more. Name, age, and what's your toxic trait? I think trait? that dude over your shirt. My toxic trait is, I, I think, I... Oh, he trying to convince somebody he ain't gay or something <laughs> over there. consistent. He looking down. Though, you know what I'm saying? He like, pop soon, they say something. The same energy I put in, I I'm a woman. the pop. same thing. Oh. And some people don't give you that. And... That's not toxic. Exactly. <laughs> oh, old nigga. That part. That's it. So That's no it. one has to be toxic. That's okay. That's okay. okay. <laughs> Look at it. Uh, the most important step to any get ready. Yeah, arm and hammer. That's what you're going to need. You're going to need an arm and hammer. To hold that big woman down. All right, so Look since you it. asked that question. Look at she not walking heels. Um... I like to be love bombed. Last time she I had, last time she walked in heels was oh, at the banquet. Okay. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Why did we have to at the banquet for her um, award That's ceremony? Like, she don't wear dresses, you want man. Me to love bomb you, like understanding what love bombing is. Yes. No. <laughs> and I just told you I can be nonchalant, so it won't work. Yeah. Okay. Understood. Yeah. Got it. So before you ended up hopping over the love bombing thing, is she someone that's your type? She's attractive. Yeah, she could be around. I don't know if she could be <laughs> permanently or not, but she could be around for sure. Okay. <laughs> you know how you are. Right. And now, is he someone that's your type? Um, yeah, I guess. He's cool. Mm-hmm. All right. We're going to do that. <laughs> and we do have one balloon left unpopped. Look at him. Look him. questions between the two of you? No. Uh, Drunk you uncle. Have no. You have any questions? No. <laughs> how do you deal with your trauma? Um, I go to therapy. That part, we ain't got no more questions. Man. Look, he, he want to win. He <laughs> trying to leave with something, man. How do you deal with your trauma? Therapist. Yeah, it's the best. Yeah. It's the that best part. ever. Yeah. Right. Yeah. He trying to leave with something, man. That nigga nasty, man. Right. He lying. What's up, baby? Any other questions between you two? No, I ain't got no. Um, I'm <laughs> doing a, oh, okay. We call this pop the balloon. Come on up. Come on up. <laughs> no, I'm doing. Right. I'm recording the video. Oh, All right, so y'all say you have no further questions, so I'm gonna this go nigga ahead and mine. So, is it gonna be a yes for you first? This an old nigga. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and is it a yeah, yes old nigga. He said he's 38. Ooh. Huh? I'm gonna get John. Okay, so <laughs> what is going on? I love you, baby. <laughs> hey, we. Hey, you gotta watch this, man. You gotta. <laughs> I'm not judging men. Be quiet. I, I am judging men. I think that's the first thing I said. That's wild. Okay. He's like, I don't continue no judging you. men. Uh, he, he wore whole ass glasses inside and it's like 10 o'clock at night. Um, and I just couldn't hear half the things that he was saying. Mm, okay. All right. Well, that is all the balloons popped. But we do thank you for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for wow. her. Wow. I'll take this. She ain't want to be real, yo. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello. Let's see what this is. Oh. And what's your name? I'm Michelle Brassel. Isho. Michelle Brazil. Oh, Michelle. Okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, and how old are you? I'm 37. Ugh. And what do you do? I'm a tax professional, and I also work for accounts payable for a very large fire and safety company. Mm. Very nice. Uh, what you are them throat lozenges. Um, I was raised in ballroom dancing, so I love to dance. You um, look like it. I love to sing. I love to travel. I love parks. Um, it's probably easier if I say what I don't like. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, someone who's generous, and I don't mean by giving out their pocket, but just a very kind person. Mm-hmm. Someone who knows how to communicate without yelling. Mm-hmm. I don't like the yelling. I'm from the East Coast, so I'm used to aggressiveness. However, I like to stay in this energy. Yeah. Um, someone who likes to dress. Someone um, who loves to read. Mm. Um, like to cook with me. Okay. <laughs> now, what are some deal breakers? Someone who yells. Oh. Consistently. If that's how you communicate, that would be a deal breaker for me. Okay. Got I it. I feel you. All right. So. I'm sorry, yelling. We do have like, like I tell you, man. I tell, that dude, he ain't, trying to, he ain't there for nobody. Watch. For look at the ground. 
My name is Micah, and I'm 42. I'm 42. Uh, the reason I pop was just so if if I'm looking for somebody, like want to be in a relationship with somebody, I'm looking to marry that person. So if I if I'm like uh, dating somebody, I wanna I wanna marry that person and, and call her my wife. And I just you are very pretty. Thank you. But I just couldn't see you as like being my wife. I, I do. Okay. Y'all both short. Now is Micah someone that's your type? Um, yes, he's very handsome. Um, so he had, energy. Um, I feel where he's saying on the energy, but he ain't got no energy. As as attraction goes. I'm telling you, he's he's very, soon, soon the girl say something, he just bah. All right. Hear him get out of this so like somebody. Let's go ahead and ask these guys a question. He got an anxiety problem. Help us narrow it down. Well, I like to keep it fun. He ain't show no personality. He ain't so show no interest in none of these like girls. He ain't smile. Start over he here just, with your name and age. What do you like to do for fun? I'm live forty. Um, I like to travel. I do comedy. I like going to comedy shows and stuff. And yeah, you know. You ain't That's made me laugh place. yet. This is That's your worst performance. This is the other time. This is the most people somebody gonna Name see you. And you ain't you told like to one joke. Fun? You better do something funny, nigga. Bro, you really? That's crazy. You smell like you've been marinated in. How wet you gonna say dog? you're a comedian? You ain't made nobody really? laugh yet, bro. Oh. Come on. Uh, Hubert, 37. Uh, it's probably easier to ask me what I don't like to do. Um, <laughs> but love to go to the movies, love live music, going to college football games, traveling, eating good food. Awesome. All the good things. Pleasure. Yep. All right. Your name and age, and what do you like to do for oh, fun? Dick. I'm Johnny. I'm 38. I like going. I like nature. You know what I'm saying? I like meditating and not mean trying to warm myself. What about that? Um, and trying to get closer to God. You try to get closer That's to God. Right. Enjoy Come on, it. Right. That's it. You lie. Nice to meet you. Name and age, and what do you like to do for fun? I'm Danny. I'm 38. <clears throat> I like to uh, play chess. That's I'm your an avid reader. Um, now you read. She run. says, "Am I read?" Now you read. No, look like a little bit. Oh, no, you do say you read books and shit online. So my bad, my bad. bad. Um, and like to just chill, my. You did say like play chess, though. So. I do have one. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, let's head on back. So I am now going to hand you a pic. Okay. Let me have you hold that. Oh, this is and always the hard part. Yes, the hard part. <laughs> I'm going to have you pop one balloon based off of what you heard, what you see, whatever it is. Go ahead and pop that one. Okay. Granddaddy, are you? <laughs> okay. Didn't so mean to do that so adamantly. Why did we end up popping his balloon? Um... The eye connection for me. Um, I like to be intimate with someone that I chose, and I know you've been here for a while, but me too. <laughs> <laughs> that part. So that was really it for me. If I could um, have a little bit more intimacy, I probably wouldn't have. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. So but you're very handsome. You're cool. No, she's cool. And Johnny, why did you um, have your balloon unpopped? I mean, she seemed cool, and I mean, she's gorgeous. I mean, all that. <laughs> okay. All right. Cool. Thank you. All right, and we did get a pop back here. Why did we end up popping our balloon? Um, what's your nationality? I'm Cubanita and Italiana. Yeah. Who? I like black women, like, you know. Um, we are black, nothing, but that's yes, okay. Yes, no problem. I mean, like, <laughs> She's black. No, 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 not. Of course they're all black. You know, I'm from New York. All Spanish, everything is black. But, you know, like, just, that's just, yeah. Okay. You're beautiful. I love your manners. I like how you greet everybody. But... Like you said, um, if I'm looking to get into sure. a relationship for marriage, I want like a, you know, a black woman. For I you. understand. Thank you. No problem. She said she black, my nigga. So now is Law someone that's your type? Well, we're both from New York. I'm from Flatbush. So initially the energy, yes. But um, we do, we are very strong on a preference. So, um, yeah, looking at him, yes. But um, I kind of feel the, the different chemistry. Yeah. Thank you. All right, so we do have two balloons left unpopped. I can go ahead and ask these guys another question. Do you gentlemen have any children? Okay, they both have kids. How many children? How many? Okay, start over here. I have one. And how old? Oh, I'm sorry. Was that no, yeah. oh. <laughs> He's two years old. He's two. And how was your relationship with the baby mother? Um, we are amicable legally. Sure. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's go down over here. Okay, how many kids do you have? I got two kids. Um, one is 18, and the other one is five. Started over. And the relationship with the mother? 
Oh, uh, yeah, my first child's mother, we was we known each other since middle school, so we done went through all the BS. We cool. Y'all grown Second now. One, she's cool. She done moved on. <laughs> I'm just cool. Be honest with you. I'm really just do cool. The drama thing. You right. I fix it. <laughs> That's how I am. Something to consider? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. And guys, any questions for our lady? Right here? Okay. Sure. Um, so I have two questions. Okay. Sure. Uh, do you have kids? I do not. Okay. Are you got no kids? Uh, and you reside where? In Colorado. Okay. In Colorado. I live in Chicago. I love Chicago. Travel there quite often, actually. <laughs> Good? Yep. Knock, knock. I don't know, man. She, um... That's <laughs> Joker. Yeah, I don't see nothing wrong with her so far, you know? What does it mean to be human? Oh, man, all of them cats. Is it our imperfections or our pursuit of... All right. She's Any straight, man. She's straight. She probably so, get mean. In this day and age, um, women really had the upper hand. Well, it's like this lineup, you got a lot of men to choose from. So how do you show the person that you with that you're just as interested in him as he is in you? It's time you meet at the club, not the club, the bar. Um, you know what I mean? For me, um, I have a very strong domesticated streak. So even though I run my own business, um, I help people with their finances. You be there at a night club. Keep them on track, out of jail with the IRS. Not the loud clubs like and shit. Be the and be the grown and sexy. With my partner. You got to approach I her. like how we can have individual time because my job can be a little bit demanding. But I like to make sure that I'm always resetting and focused mm. on home. Having two separate lives. When I walk out the door and I'm a professional, I'm a professional. When I come home, I'm my man's woman. 100%. I, I bet she get me because she got a little raspy voice. For sure. You good? Yeah, yeah. I'm okay, right. all right. <laughs> so let's head back over here. We did get a pop. Why did we end up popping our balloon? Um, I think she's a beautiful woman. Uh, she's great, great energy. I just don't see her being my person. Like I, I can't see that. Okay. This is nigga. They don't want to pop it. Is uh, Hubert someone that's your type? Um, not typically, but I am geared more towards towards personality, not really looks. Got it. So I would um, definitely give him an opportunity to speak. And See? our last guy over here crazy, to pop in. Why did we pop our balloon? Well, to be honest with you, <coughs> the, the New York aggressive thing, oh. I feel like I like um, my women a little, a little tad bit softer. Okay. You know, uh, I'm a chill, laid back dude. And, you know, Ooh. I liked her to be even more submissive than that. And like, you're very beautiful. I just. Are you gonna submit to me without me having to? I gotta get some damn, you know, buff up a little bit to, you know, what I'm saying to put sure. control you down. I just, I just want to chill. Sure. And I know New Yorkers, they be like, nah, nigga. <laughs> Not this one. As <laughs> yeah, I said, I don't like to yell. <laughs> <Nope. laughs> like Y'all crazy, man. At all times. She, I, she I straight, you, man. Very beautiful, well, though, sweetheart. You. you know, what I'm saying hair look nice. Outfit look good, you know what I'm saying? You. For your fingernails, match your toes, and everything. So. <laughs> you good. Well, thank you. Thank All you right. for your time. Now, is Danny someone that's your type? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. Let's head on back. So that is all of the balloons popped, unfortunately. But we These dudes crazy. Y'all keep letting them go you. by. Let's go ahead and thank give it up. Thank you. kind of stocky, but you take that dress off. She might got something funny there. Y'all crazy. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single right? lady. Six, she moved up to a seven by keeping her mouth shut and not scanning. What, what, you know? Hello, she, welcome in. What's your name? What My is name is Melissa Gemma. Melissa, oh, okay. Lord. And yes. how old are you? I'm 36. And what do you do? So I am a property manager as well as TV and film hairstylist and makeup artist. Nice. Boo Ghetto, that's what she now, is. She bougie and ghetto. I like to eat. <laughs> okay. Do y'all know how to cook? Anybody? Oh. <laughs> so, yes, I'm a foodie. I mm -hmm. love to eat. I love all different types of food. Mm -hmm. Don't eat pork, um, but I'm open to trying, you know, pretty much anything. Her. Okay. She's um, straight. I'm a creative, so anything of the arts, pretty much, you know, 
I'm passionate about. She I love music. Well. Nice. I love books. <clears throat> I love art. I love museums. Um, yeah. Okay. No. I just love to have fun. Like as long as it's a good time, it's mm-hmm. a vibe. We're being safe. We gotta see if you're fake good. though. Yeah. All right. <laughs> now, what are some things you look for in a man? You got the look, you know. Oh. Okay. We'll see. Hold on. We'll see you. Um, I desire a man. Um, a man of God. Mm. Okay. A man of God for sure. Mm. Um, he That's doesn't. I'm not gonna say you have to be in church every Sunday because I'm I'm on my journey as well. Mm-hmm. However, you have to be willing to you know want to like that white that makeup on the relationship eye. with that God. That's crazy. really important to me. Okay. Um, she like an eight, a progressive huh? man. A, uh, a man who is love, purpose driven. Love, 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 love. That's really important to me as well. Because if you don't know your purpose, you don't know why you're here. Just my arms they on the nose. Never live up to your fullest potential. Shit. Um. Definitely Just coming off his marriage fate. minded. A man who is intentional about what he wants. Um yeah. provision. And not just from All a that. financial aspect, because I know we get up here and say, Oh, I want to provide <laughs> oh, it. Come with that hood shit. That's what I'm talking about. Right. But it encompasses so much more than just finances. Okay. Like, Stock rising. Obviously a leader. I have a son. I have I a bet. six year old son. You know somebody sprayed um, at the club. You great know. kid. Myself and his father, we co-parent very well. Mm-hmm. So he has to be a man that is willing to, you know, accept a woman with a child mm-hmm. and also kind of know how to navigate that type of relationship. Because if you're going to be with me, we are a package deal. Mm-hmm. Of course. Bitch. Um, and just, you know. I'm going to say something we already, don't, I already know. Okay. Um, have a plan. And just know from? how to, you know, I mean, you got two hands. I may be a little bit of a handful, but that's in a good way. <laughs> okay. Now, what are some deal breakers? Give um, me like two. Deal breakers. Mm-hmm. Let me see. Deal breakers. Uh, I would say someone who lacks emotional intelligence. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, you have to be emotionally aware. Just mm-hmm. have some tact. Um, just kind of know how to communicate. She's born. She doing all the That's talking. Really big, which I know is. We don't nobody believe her. Everybody talks about it because it's trending, but it's really the truth. Okay. Um, mm, anger. Is it pants or a skirt she got on? That is a deal breaker for me. Got it. Uh, you look you can't better than pants. Anger. The outfit. Okay. Um, there was some pants. Good. You okay. got those too. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So it's a little we dress or something. Okay. Let's go on over there. Look, yeah. Okay. Your name and age, and why did you end up popping your balloon? Yeah, my name is Micah, and I'm 42. Hi, Micah. How you doing? I'm great. How are you? You scared of her. Okay. And Micah, why did you end up popping your balloon? I ain't coming here for no bitch The reason why I popped, well, first off, I just wanted to hear what she had to say. Mm -hmm. And what really uh, caught my attention (laughs) is when she was talking about a man of God or someone, a man that's trying to seek God. (laughs) He don't like God now. I gravitated to that. So, uh, Uh and then... Just the things she was saying, it, it was really, you know, it intrigued me. Okay. The things she was saying. So why you pop? And um, but yeah, so the reason I pop was because just just the she's a, she's a bit too slender for my type. Okay. But she's you are you are very pretty. Thank you. Yeah. You're nice looking too. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Uh, thank you, Micah. All right, let's head on back. So we been do WWE. have four guys she, remaining. Yeah, all right, Jackie. Like Jackie. Like Jacqueline. So who's What's more your name? type? So, fellas, let's see. Uh, Got a mean little face uh, on you, though. Look, she, she don't know how you. do you handle temptation? She can trick somebody. Don't fall for her, y'all. Okay. Let's start with your name she, and age and the answer to her question. This uh, nigga in the white uh, Dior 40. shirt, he dumb as hell, boy. How do I handle temptation? Yes. In a relate now you're in a relationship. This, I'm not saying as a single man. What are so you trying to do? What's she trying to accomplish? Commitment yeah. to a woman. And I what's she trying to accomplish? You this? know, there's going to be temptation. We're human. We're Absolutely. all attracted to people. So how do you handle temptation when you have made a commitment to someone and you got Shirley Ralph your face and she's everything that you like? And you trying to be the next host of this show right, or something? Let's hear from him. Sure, you're very outspoken, ain't you? <laughs> Um, basically, it's self-control. Like, okay. when you get to this age, you got to have self-control. If I'm in a relationship, I'm basically blind to everybody else. I'm Stevie Wonder. That's it. Okay, Stevie. <laughs> Thank you. Annie's can promise real, purposeful ingredients that make Come everybody on. smile. Get back to this boring-ass couple. Got Let's it. go over here with your name and age, and how do you handle temptation? Uh, Hubert, 37. Hubert? Um, Hubert. I have different tactics. You look like a damn Hubert. You like a Hugh? 
in a for bird. Sure, prey on it. Um, I'm you're a like big a goldfish. Blocker. Like I will block you. Okay. Um, I can't in my last it. relationship, I went and removed all of the women. That you like I some kind of amphibious with. animal be temptation. I don't um, know what it is. Also, I just don't is put myself in situations where I gotta deal with that. Because I am human. So, yep. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> Let's go over here. Your name and age, and how do you handle temptation? Johnny, I'm 38. I handle temptation. I pray a lot, and I talk. Okay, you used to be an alcoholic, man. <laughs> I'm telling you, you old, man. I know you old, man. Okay. You getting back in the okay. spirits and the Lord Last and shit. Here. Name and age, and how do you handle temptation? I'm Danny. I'm 38. To be honest with you, it was um, I've adapted the philosophy of monogamy because there's a lot of financial and personal growth benefits that come from that. So I really don't get tempted drop the balloon back there. when I'm in a relationship because I've engulfed myself into the relationship. So other women just don't matter. Got you. Was she pre- getting ready for the WWE? Sh- she has some big arms. All right. So, based off of those responses you heard, whatever you see, all that good stuff, I am going to have you pop. So, let me give you a pick. Okay. And let's go so. ahead and pop one balloon. All right. Oh, Danny. Well, uh, why would you let it go? <laughs> okay. So, why did we end up popping his balloon? Um, Honestly, his answer was really, really good. Just the... um. I'm the physical attraction. Okay. Yeah. Just not like a connection or, you know. Yeah. Okay. And now, Johnny, why did you have your balloon unpopped? You want a real answer? Yeah. I'm your trying to respond. take home to my mama. You hear me? She, she love your show. Okay. <laughs> I told you. She's, she's not your type? <laughs> no, nah, she's too skinny. I'm, she she I'm trying to show. take some home you. to mom. She love Thank your you. show. All right. Thank you. <laughs> That's it. I'm back. All right, I'm going to go ahead and have you ask the remaining three guys another Hello, question. Um, My camera okay. out of focus. So, uh, you said I'm trying to take something home. The family That's dynamic. funny, man. Who comes first? Okay. Who comes first? Yeah, man, she... Um, I have kids, so my kids come first. Okay. She a six, yo. Yeah. She went back down. We're married. Okay. Hold on. The mic ain't even on you yet, Hubert. Sorry. Who comes first? If I'm married, my wife. So, let me rephrase that. Mm-hmm. Her hair look ratty, in terms too. Of the family dynamic. That's why I swayed on that side. She knew what side she, the camera was on. As far as hierarchy is concerned, the she, order of the family, in order losing point, shorty. for you to have sustainability, who comes first in your relationship? Look, your makeup wearing off in that light. God. There's you a look, face look a little lighter. Right. Okay. And the I rest. Mean, well, you got too up. much makeup on. <laughs> it's like, you passable. You can do more. some shit. You can trick right, somebody. Me. Okay. Period. You know, uh, Period. on the head. Uh, my own usually like when dudes say that. He said that at the right time. And, you know. It must have been period, nigga. Follows that. I when follow dudes God, say period, I think they kind of zesty. Dude shouldn't say period. Head on back. Or it tea. is time to pop a balloon. So, out of these three remaining, and none guys, of my homies should never have the tea. Pop. My nigga, come me. Hey, girl, I got the tea up. The tea. <laughs> Dude shouldn't say period. Okay, let's stay over here. So, why did we end up popping his balloon? Um, it just seemed that, I mean, great answer. I, I just think it was very. Um, centered, self-centered, like me, just me. It was his answer. You know, family consists of more than just you. You said the head, the hierarchy. Right, which is God. Okay, we can not talk about that. That's all. That's just universal. That's that's uh that's understood. You know, what's understood ain't gotta be explained. But you know, what I'm saying that's cool. When it, mm-hmm. it comes to like, it's not even a discussion to be honest with you. Right. Like it's my household you're coming into, like. Mm-hmm. It's my kingdom. You know, I ain't never seen a king put a queen over him. I wasn't looking yeah. for, um, I don't think there's an issue with your perspective. However, um, God comes first, then the husband, then the wife, 
than the children, so on and so forth. That's exactly what I said. But I, right. <laughs> no problem. Are okay. you very beautiful? Thank you. know you. what I'm saying? That's why I had the balloon on pop. You Thank know what I'm saying? Everything about you is A1. You went that wow. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Okay, thank you. Let's head on back. Yeah. Okay, we did get a pop back here. Why did we end up popping? Um, just didn't feel the aura. There's a connection and vibe. That's it. The energy. She's beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, but um, you're yeah, throwing that word beautiful out there lightly, know, man. And educated too. So, but Is I just she? didn't feel the aura and the connection. Got it. Okay. Now, is Law someone that's your type? Um. I would. I would go on. I would go out on a date. Okay. I would. Mm -hmm. He's nice looking. I like the colors. You Thank look you. good in the herb tone. Thank you. <laughs> you know? He's catfish. Uh -huh. so we do have one more balloon left unpopped. So, any final questions between the two of you? Um, let's see. Do you she have any children? Yeah. I have one. He's oh. two years old. <laughs> look, she's trying to get out of it. Like, yeah. mm -hmm. Too young. Any any babies under five? Okay. Yeah, it's a deal breaker for me. I just didn't get a chance to say it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? Um, she cool. Um, right. Yeah, like, uh, I think she's attractive. She had a nice little body on her. Thank um, you. Not too skinny? No, nah, I like slim women, so it's cool. <laughs> um, <laughs> See, the camera must add 10 pounds because um, she don't look that small. She didn't say anything. That she looked small. Pop, she got big but, arms and shit. Yeah. But it happens. Right. Now, I know the kids was a little the too long, young, but the is he someone that's The longer you look at her face, like, though, it's a, you go for him? It's so, he is actually isn't my type, but just based off of his answers, I definitely would have, yeah. Okay. Shut up, bitch. Thank yeah, you. you answered exactly how I would have. That's what I was looking for. You got it right. <laughs> all right, so that is all the balloons popping. You're going to have a deal break this nigga. Thank you so much for coming kids. on. Be Let's quiet. go ahead and give it up you for her, bag guys. You got a She look better when you get up on the face a little bit. Um... Six Thank you, everyone, for tuning into this episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. If you'd like to be... Oh, that's it. Damn. There you go, man. Y'all seen it. It's Pop the Balloon or Find Love, episode 22. Um, The longer you look at people, the better they look or the or less attractive they do look. That's how I judge people on here. The women on here. I don't never judge the dudes. Contrary to what my wife say. Um, <clears throat> yeah, that's it. It was our episode, man. Um, they left a lot of damn money on the table. They, they, they the dudes, y'all, the dudes. What is y'all doing? Yeah, man, her toenails ain't done right up. Never judge a woman off her toenail color. These dudes weird, man. Anyway, I go live on the channel every Friday at nine p.m. right here on this channel, man. I go live at 9 p.m. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimper that I'm putting out when I put it out. But until next time, man, this has been Pop the Balloon of Fire and Love, episode 22. Check me out, man. Send me in the comment section what you think about these people. Until then, I'll let your boy Heist Man the foe. This is a dangerous group, is it? Groups that we're dealing with now. All right, this time, but I'll be back, and sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.